we already did our welcome, but um, I'd like to introduce to you our uh, long-term friend and collaborator and the, the life and blood and the soul of what we're trying to do down here, uh, the, the, the head of Woodlands Conservancy. This is uh, Miss Katie Braston. Katie, hello. 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 It's cold, but for the California folks to say it's cold, it's, it must be cold. <laughs> I mean, to go from 75 yesterday to 38 today, uh -huh. like, waiting for you all to come back, and then they're just like, how to make a hoop house cover <laughs> from a raised bed part? It's going to freeze tonight. Uh -huh. And it's like, I just planted all of my plants like two weeks ago. Oh, no. I put 16 tomato plants in the garden last week. Yeah, yeah, definitely gonna have to go into shock. Yeah, yeah, well, probably 16 yeah, more yeah. in my little, little starter beds. But, um, well, welcome everybody. I'm so glad you came this year. I really miss having this group here. Um, I'm sure that Sean told you a little bit about Woodlands. Um, we now own this, which is phenomenal. Owned it now, not even for a whole month. So, oh, wow. official, official. Wow. wait a minute. No, I guess it'll be two months and a few days. Oh, okay. so we're on our own property. We can do whatever we want. Oh, oh, yeah. 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 So, we've been managing this for since 2004, and in I think it was in 2015, uh, the, actually, we found out about it because we read it on the front page of the paper that the Parish was planning on turning uh, this into 20 baseball fields oh, oh, with oh, oh, oh. bunk houses, and it's like, mm -mm. Nope. honestly, I looked at the story, and the story was a, it was a painting of a little boy with his baseball cap on backward, <laughs> carrying a baseball bat over his shoulder, walking through the woods. <laughs> well, that's hilarious. Like <laughs> that can't happen, right? And honestly didn't take it seriously because I thought it was just too ludicrous. But um, then to find out that actually there were plans to make that happen. And so um, we submitted it for what's called oil spill remediation project, which you can submit through your state oil spill coordinator's office. Uh, and you can also submit them through NOAA's for a damage assessment and restoration project. And work with the state and federal trustees since 2015 on trying to make that a reality. Uh, we went to the Plaquemines Parish government who owned the property and said, you know, we've been here all these years uh, providing a unique recreational opportunity for your community and you really need the money. So you can have your cake and eat it too. We'll continue to stay here and manage the property. Open to the public. Right, and you get the money, and it's a win-win. 